So in accelerating research and development in S&T, I've discovered in my time there being over a year at that organization that we do not have the time or the luxury to look at traditional research and development uh, going forward. It just takes too much time. We're in a law enforcement agency. The customers at S&T uh, demand a solution immediately, for lack of a better term. Uh, so we're really ramping up and, and building a robust, comprehensive, uh, complete uh, technology scouting effort within the Department of Homeland Security and S&T. Um, I think that's going to drive a lot of the faster turnarounds for technologies that we need. As technology or requirements come in or capability gaps come into us, we're going to actually go out there and do a global search for what technologies are available and at what level of development they're in. And if we need to round that out with more R&D, we will. So if we have a technology scouting capability and we find a customer out there that's able to deliver, we have to have the tools to get them involved in our product and our processes much faster. So we have other transactional authorities that Congress has given to us that allow us to procure some of these capabilities much more quickly. We have our Silicon Valley Innovative Program, which is one of our programs that allow us to use that. We also have our crowdsource innovative uh, prize uh, competitions where we can actually tap into entrepreneurs, startups, uh, students, it, it doesn't matter. If they've never been involved in government before, we're able to get them on board quickly and take advantage of their innovation and bright ideas to solve the problems.